Oh, water. Back on the menu. Delicious. Exterior grow bed. Oh, no. No, no, no. Interior grow bed. What is, like, the quickest way... Oh, my God, you can rotate them. Uh, not quickest. Like, most efficient layout is kind of wonky. That is going to slowly destroy my soul. So... I think maybe, you know, we're kind of committing a little bit more to this being the base that we sit in. Are we gonna, can we fit more in? Oh, uh, this is going to be... I bet there is a way. Because I still want to be able to, like, run through nicely. I guess it doesn't even matter if they are in the way. I can just walk over it. Okay, that's probably enough for now. Uh, where were my plants? Okay, uh, wait, Ming plant seed, did we, we didn't even eat that, did we? Oh, well, fuck it, just plant it anyway. Wow. Did that really grow that quickly? Can I? Oh, because it was already, like, a thing. Okay, shit, maybe I should have got more seeds rather than... I don't know. We'll work it out. Look at this non-stop professionalism. Boom. Uh, and... Crowbird? And then... is a proven survival strategy. Craig McGill survived 47 months on a healthy, raw salad of live tree roaches and stank root. Damn, that's good stank root. Uh, there we go. That's probably where I should be planting. Do you have any of that good, delicious... Mmm, water and salt. Ambassador, you treat us so. Uh, oh, I can put the vine in. Oh, did that work? God, while we're here, let's just, like, slam down some more of these. And then we'll go off, uh, sea exploring again. Uh, we could head to the other place. Because it is deeper. Maybe we should take the prawn suit. Uh, I did want to go back to that last, um, sea base. Uh, not sea base, the other island. Um, because there was that place that we could put the Energon cube into, and that felt like a smart, smart call. Should we go in the big guy, the big boy, and, like, crab around? Where is he? Proposed to Garcia sea base. Where is that? Oh god, that feels like spooky water. Is that where we went last time? What the fuck are you? Oh. Oh, I think you're the top of my thing, but you came off. But it's like a drone or something, like, flying over, like, from this angle. Doesn't it look like a little, like, beep boop? Hello, it's me. Hey, get out of there. Mom, I am home from school. That's not for you. Although if it's 500 meters deep, are we going to get stuck? Maybe we just do stick with the uh, speedy relaxation that is Sea Baby. Sploosh. Welcome aboard Gal Systems Online. Yeah, no worries. How you doing? Okay, so we're heading over to Deep Water. 500 meters, not that deep. I feel like I probably should have been here a long time ago. Uh, but you know what? Sometimes it's okay, you know, uh, different, different speeds for different folks. Reef back, you chill. I feel like, oh god, sorry, I was looking at the reef back. Oh, I don't feel as good about this now. This is like literally where we just were. Um, when we went on Fisto's great adventure. Yeah, shit, we're gonna see how, um, Sea Baby handles, uh, Handles the great adventure. Um, oh my god, we are so close to running people over. Ah, oh, we should get some Reginalds while we're here. I want, like, some Reginalds and take them back to the base. And I'll put them in with all of my lovely, healthy friends. Once again, that noise, not a big fan of. Where's that base gone? Oh, it's just, like, down. Okay. Uh. Okay. What is that? 
Oh, it's just a rock. It's just a rock. That was like the... Not the main bit, but you see that like lighter shape? I thought that was like a... Built formation, but... Coming along. No, it's just like... It was just like illuminated. Oh, and, <laughs> and like popped in. Um, so that's why it looked weird. Right, where the hell are we going? God, I maybe should have brought a bigger boy. Like a big fisty boy. God, I just miss fisting stuff. Wow, Fisto would have loved this. I'll have to write back to him and tell him about all these adventures. God, that's a whole nother... <gasps> oh, it's him. God, is he coming towards me? Surely you're not allowed up to... Jeez, the... the my water, water like jet scared me. I thought that was like a spooky ghost coming for me. Hmm. Oh, if I don't have the lights on, is that better? I only guess no. What was that? Oh, it's like echolocation. Oh shit, the bed. Oh, let's, oh geez. <laughs> Let's just go for it. God, there's warpers. This is like a very busy, exciting place. Ugh, I hate them. Like squid spiders. How do these guys find this base and decide like, yeah, let's fucking live here. In hell. Okay, right, I'm worried they're gonna like grab Sea Baby. Detecting a titanium mass somewhere in this area. Unable to confirm whether it originated on the Aurora. Titanium mass? Integrating new PDA data. Okay, we found part three of whatever their, like, stupid survival adventure is. Oh. Oh, it's Paul Torg. Okay. Came out of nowhere. An alien kraken, bigger than a cyclops. Tore a hole clear through the reinforced hull. I barely got my breather in time. I told her. I said others would come. The rupture threw me clear of the habitat. And the monster turned and bore down on me. And just as its tentacles came within reach, Mader appeared out of nowhere. She had a sea glide in one hand, a jagged piece of scrap metal in the other. She meant to butcher that beast or die trying. The last I saw her, she had the metal lodged in its neck as the monster did its best to shake her, contorting off into the darkness. I'm certain she got her wish, one way or another. Then I thought I saw a light deep below me. I hope maybe Bart had swum clear. I followed it. Now I wonder whether I saw anything at all. Oh my god. Our oxygen is low. <gasps> The habitat is gone. I can't see the sky. Something surely has the scent of my blood. Oh my god. Integrating new PDA data. Whoever the fucking voice actor is for that, I love that voice. Um new blueprint acquired. And Yeah. Spooky fucking times, not gonna lie. Um Okay. Big sea monster came down, um, spooked around, was a bad boy, all round. Oh my god. Oh my god, it knows I'm in here. Sh shit, my dude. Hello. God, I'm worried that... Sometimes this game can, like, glitch a little bit and that it's going to pluck me up through the, the ceiling. Okay, so we have another another installment of Spooky Times. Please, stop fighting and listen. We're sick. What? How? You've been coughing, right? Feeling itchy? Blisters? Yeah. Oh my god, he's the watching me. The biometrics would have warned us if we were sick. It's something new. It's not in the database. Come on, man, what's it going to do? Turn us inside out. Dissolve us into jelly. It's an alien bacteria. It's everywhere. Every organism Fuck. on this planet. It's altering our genetic code. Uh, how are the creatures surviving if they're infected? I don't know yet. Want me to cut some of them open for you? Find out what makes them tick? 
No. Just tell me what you need, son. Materials. Equipment. Just... Oh, shit. Can I have some quiet? I need some time to think. We're going for it. Okay, right. There's, like, another mention of, like, plague. Gotta watch out for plague. Um, we're definitely c carrying the plague. Um, and there's fucking sea monsters everywhere. And warpers. God. Where's your big punching arms when you need them? Um, I feel like this. I should be looking for something else down here. Did we get all of the PDAs? Maybe. God, but these guys are just fucking spooky. <gasps> what was that noise? That was like a like a whale fart. Oh no, we totally didn't. We didn't go up. What a dum dum. God, I'm not sure how much I care for those guys. They. Oh, spooky boys. Did he f bite my ship? You ultimate jerk off. Where's my. Uh. You. Oh my god, he did give it a little nip. Where is it? Is it behind me? No. I no. God, how do I get in there? Oh. Here? Oh, alien containment! Oh, we can have, like, a big fish tank. Cyclops shield generator. Sounds nice. I like the idea of having shields. PDA. Integrating new PDA data. I have had it with you risking our lives. Oh, stow it, Chief. The kid can't kill this disease without fish to study. I'm just bringing him home. But tell her. Tell her I'm right. You're both wrong. Marguerite, I can't find out how they resist the bacteria if you slaughter them all. It ain't always they oblige in coming in alive. He means you're being reckless. Father, the outcome's no better if oh. we hold up in here and don't go outside. That we have to find a middle way. There is no compromise. Not while she's on my sea base. Your sea base? I'm going outside. Bart, Torical has disembarked the habitat. Bart, come in. It's dangerous. Damn it, boy. I know you can hear me. Chief. Chief, get off the radio and put on your helmet. What? Brace! Uh integrating new PDA data. Okay, right. Um we didn't listen to this one. Okay, we did not do these in order at all. What are you so happy about, Mida? Jesus. I brought you some. Is that oh, a shit. outside? Towed it home on the back of the sub. You killed that thing? It's still breathing. I was about to finish the job, but I can stay in chat if you'd like. Stop. No. You make yourself useful and pass me that hardened blade. Are you uh, out of your mind? He's biting you my that ship. Thing here? What if it's not as dead as it looks? What if others come? You prefer it got curious and came of its own accord, or got messed up and dragged here? When we get off this planet, I am going to drag you through every court in the damn Federation. Okay, right. Um, have we got everything from that base? The question is that, and the answer is maybe. Oh, jeez. Dude, I really like you guys, but, man, like, you gotta be careful. I am very much on edge. So is this where we came in last time? God, like... Oh, there's, like, a signal. Um, one thing I did notice, we got a yellow tablet. Is that what we needed for... Skull Base. Skull Cave. Not that I have 
any idea where where that would be. Beacon. Skull cave that way. Shit, if we just surface and then came back down into it, I'm pretty sure that that was like right right next to it. Or do we want to risk going through and getting eaten by um, spooky, spooky ghost eels? How deep down did we go? Uh, we definitely went down to like the brine level. Oh no, are we doing this? This is definitely where we die. Uh, okay. This kind of looks familiar. Well, at least the pods that I wanted to punch. Um, while we're surrounded by, like, more chill dudes. God, I really hope those guys are chill. And it just isn't. I've just been super lucky this whole time. How are we for power? We're good for power. Uh... Oh, wait. This feels way too close. Is this the same one? Oh, there's the door. <gasps> yeah! Look at us, playing games like a professional. Can we take Sea Baby in? Ow, 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 ow. Look, Look it's a little bit bumpy, but you are allowed in. Hmm. Okay. Oh, scannables. Alien flora specimen case. Very cool. Research equipment. Eggs. Energon cubes. Elk fuck. Hmm, maybe we don't need so many fucking bags. <laughs> uh, there we go. Uh, so in the future, someone's going to find this place and be like, oh, What is this ancient alien artifact for storing materials? Uh, mixed Leviathan fossils. Is there anything else? You going to be scanned? God, I really want one of these guys in my base. Like... Uh, <laughs> what's those things? God. Okay, right. Just do this. Integrating new PDA data. Okay. Cool. Should we get out of here? I like the sea baby could come inside here. Uh, new PDA data. Alien data. Scan data. Alien flora research. Local plants being held in stasis. The alien evidently sought extensive knowledge of the plant's ecosystem. Okay, very cool. Research table. Equipment maintenance, staff maintenance, species analysis. Uh, gene manipulation. Okay, spooky. Uh, alien research data on the local fauna with special focus on their reproductive methods. Oh my god, you saucy aliens. Uh, core conclusions have been synthesized. They discovered a life forms on the planet have just one sex. They observed local organisms engaging in asexual reproduction. Um, the all healthy individuals tested were capable of egg laying. Very cool. Eggs usually require genetic materials from uh, another of the species. In rare cases, only one parent was required with evolutionary mutations introduced by the effects of the environment itself. Okay, very cool. Have we got anything like super new and wacky? We react reactor rods. Swim chart fins. Charges your hell tools. Oh, love it. That sounds pretty good. That means I don't need nearly as many millions of batteries. God, we have just not checked this in a while. Crystalline sulfur. God, I want that. Let's get out of here. Oop, 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 oop. I don't know why, but I feel really, really on edge. I think it's almost because we've made, like, a little bit of progress. And so I'm worried there's, like, you know, in-game triggers that have happened. Right, Skull Cave. How the hell do we get out of there? Okay, that looks like a way up. 
Oh god, don't do it, man. Like, warpers, they can just get the hell out of here as well. Um, because they really, like, skew my vision. What's that? Is that a warper? God, what am I even flying towards? Is we going up? Oh, there. <gasps> oh, we just... Shit, that's a warper somewhere. God, I hope there's not th anything else. I am kind of... I'm gonna say 50%... No, that's generous. 20% controlled, 80%... Uh, kind of just panic sailing very... just haphazardly. Okay, we are in prime getting eaten position right now. If anything big wants to come for us, now I'd recommend be your chance. Oh, it's actually daylight. This is like a spooky dark biome. Wow. Uh, ooh, almost ran over a friend. Oh, we didn't get any Reginalds while we were there, but my inv is partially full. Oh, dude. <laughs> Uh, bonk. Um, I was looking around for just other fish that weren't you. Oh, hello, Reefbeck. Okay, new radio message. Found out about weird asexual stuff. Slugs, they're asexual, or some breeds of slugs, maybe, are asexual. Did you know that? Very interesting. Very cool. How we doing? Oh, uh, this place is looking nice. I get like a fresh drink. Very cool. Thank you. Thirst bot. Do we want this stuff? God. I don't even know what that f that's for. Like, can we repair it? Or I guess we might need them later. Hello, Disgusto Fish. Are you having a nice day? Yes, Tom. We've had a lovely day. We've been coming up with new ways to kill you. Ha ha ha. Excellent. Good job, Disgusto Fish. What is radio? Wow. Just one titanium and one copper. This is life pod 2 coordinate Oh attack. shit! We're way past our safe depth and bleeding O2. We'll have to swim for the surface, but it's 500 meters straight up. Oh god. We'll make for the rendezvous and keep you posted. Out. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Uh. Okay. If they crash landed 500 meters underwater, and they, they instantly were like, we gotta escape. Um, that was weeks ago, months maybe, of in-game time, and, uh, just gonna say, not holding out high hopes for old Life Pod 2, um, just putting it out there, like, I don't wanna be, like, a Debbie Downer, but Life Pod 2, probably pretty fucked. Oh boy, I can't wait to be born. The ocean looks so fun and carefree. I don't need to worry about anything when I'm swimming around. I can't wait to go out and explore the world. 